Have you ever wanted to go and live in Miami, Florida? If so, you know that this can be a very luxurious place to live. But it can also be a place that can be incredibly expensive to live in, depending on where you want to go. And for those who have money, it can literally be as expensive as you want to make it. So allow us to show you five of the most expensive homes in Miami. Be sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel. Number five, Sunny Isles Beach Penthouse, $38 million. So let's say you want to live in Miami. You have options on what kind of place to live in, such as a penthouse, one of which is at Sunny Isles Beach for only $38 million. You might think that this is a bit of a downturn from the houses we just showed you, especially since this place is only 9,100 square feet. But don't be fooled. It's big enough to have four bedrooms, seven bathrooms, a massive family room with a dining table that can sit 22 people, and so on and so forth. Plus, you can go out onto the balcony and experience a truly breathtaking view of the beach, as well as Miami as a whole. And if that's not the view you're wanting while on high, you also have a sky garden within the penthouse. Yup, that's luxurious. Number four, 601 Loikadendra Drive, $35 million. Sometimes a home is more than just a home, such as with 601 Loikadendra Drive, made by designer Cesar Molina, and he did a great job making this home stand out. Seven bedrooms, 11 bathrooms, as well as five other rooms that include a breakfast room and a dining room await you here. This 15,000 square foot home features all the lavishings and experiences you can imagine, including two kitchens, one for your chef and one for your butler. Yes, you heard that right, a chef and a butler. What more could you want? So pay 35 mil and get it. Number three, 2920 North Bay Road, $35 million. If you're looking for a slightly smaller Miami mansion to call home, then this one might just be for you, mainly because it's a 9,100 square foot two-story mansion that is in between a couple of other mansions. You'd still get everything you'd expect from a home like this, including multiple bedrooms, bathrooms, and even half baths, so that all your tenants are taken care of. While your house may be smallish, the fact of the matter is that the outside of the home is 50,000 square feet of beauty and greenery that is meant to make you feel much more in tune with nature, as well as in tune with your friends, because the outside areas have a variety of outdoor activities and spots for you to enjoy, such as a massive barbecue to cook out, several open air or closed off spaces to enjoy depending on the weather, a massive pool, a jacuzzi, and even a dock to house a yacht up to 100 feet in length. Number two, four Tahiti Beach Island Road. $34 million. Now let's take a look at the place at Fort Tahiti Beach Island Road. Because not only is it within a gated community, but you'll actually have a private beach to go alongside your 61,000 square feet of home space. Yup, it's all yours for $34 million. Add to that, you have a massive outdoor area to call your own, including a heated pool, lounge area, and enough greenery to lose yourself in. As for the house itself, it has 10 bedrooms, 10 bathrooms, a half bath, and much more. How much more? How about your own private wine cellar, an elevator to take you between floors, your own private theater, a gym, two kitchens, and for those who truly want to relax in their own home, there's even a spa. Plus, for those who want total control over your home, you'll be able to go and link up everything in the house to your iPad and thus be able to turn everything on and off with the push of a button. Number one, 8585 Old Cutler Road, $33 million. Finally, this plot of land has four acres of land to which you shall call your own, and 200 feet of waterfront next to it. Just some of the luxury things that you can find in this place include a pool, spa, and even your own tennis court. Seven bedrooms and eight baths await you inside your luxury home, which is decorated with style and finesse in mind, including a gorgeous chandelier. It's a bit more classic, but that's honestly part of the fun. So what do you think? What do you think of this look at the expensive homes of Miami? Which ones are you in awe of just thinking about them? Which ones would you love to stay in for a night? Do you know another expensive place to live in Miami? 
Let us know in the comments below, be sure to subscribe, and we'll see you next time on the channel.